The College Town Action Plan is still underway. Larry Parks joins us in studio with the latest. Larry? The purpose of College Town is to revamp the surrounding Winthrop community and make it more student friendly. But one professor believes that the program should focus on quality and feasibility. When people come visit the Winthrop University campus, they see the beautiful buildings and layout of the campus. But once they leave, they step into another world. I feel that Rock Hill and Winthrop are like two different cities and the Rock Hillians are more like aliens to us college students. The surrounding areas consist of many abandoned and run-down buildings. I think it's important that uh, students get an opportunity to uh, entertain themselves and as well as um, make a community for themselves. Some of those entertainment spots include restaurants, bike paths, and museums, places where students can go to enjoy themselves. Not only will the College Town program make the Rock Hill community more student friendly, it will also bring in more students for the future. One of the students' complaints is that the downtown area is not college friendly. Those stores are more like for old people or for people who need to get their taxes done. The College Town program hopes to change those views and the community. My fear is that they won't put in enough into it. I, I think it should be a long-term plan. Uh, I think, again, if you, if you s focus on the concept of it and then uh, build towards that, I think it's a better strategy than uh, trying to do sort of a mediocre job. People like Professor Durskin see the College Town program being an ongoing project just as Winthrop's campus continues to expand. Some local residents at the Council Hall meeting for College Town program fear that the program will turn the Rock Hill community into a party town. Will it? We'll keep you updated as the details unfold.